In this video guys, I'll be showing you how I bleach my frontals with the BW2 powder and 40 developer by Clairol. I'm sure if you've seen this a hundred times, if not more, I'm just pouring the powder in there and mixing in the actual developer. What I do different is, um, I really don't do, think I do anything different than anyone else. And just make sure that the consistency is more or less a paste like form so it does not um, get beyond the actual top layer of the lace when I am bleaching the knot. So here I'm just mixing it so that I can get a consistency that I like. And um, yeah, here I'm mixing, um, yeah, it's a little bit crumbly and so like I said I just wanted to be paste like so I'm very careful on how much developer I add to the bleach powder so once I get that consistency this should be able to stick to the bowl and that is my um, goal is to make sure it sticks to the bowl here I'm turning the bowl upside down and it is not running you can see some of it is on the actual hair um, applicator that I'm mixing it with and it will not fall off and that's what I'm looking for. I am now using um, some color, Purple Rage, um, a door, and it's just to get rid of the brassiness that comes from bleaching um, any hair, hair color. So this idea I did get from a YouTuber. I'll leave um, her name here at the bottom. And here I'm just mixing this in and I find that this does work. Um, just like any other corrector that you can buy. And I'm glad I got this tip. As gentle as I can, you'll see me apply a thin layer of bleach onto the lace, spreading it as gentle and as smooth as I can over the lace without pressing down into the lace. Just enough to like bleach the teeny, teeny, teeny root hairs. Um, the only issue I have with this closure, if you can see, the lace itself looks like an olive military green and um, yeah I did not like the way the lace came I don't know because I picked a color and it was like a medium but um, I rather just deal with the regular lace itself it looked like it's easier to get rid of that olivey looking color here I'm just wiping away um, any residue that I feel got onto the hairs. Um, I don't want any bleach on the hairs. Here I'm just laying down the closure on the aluminum foil. I'm going to let this sit for at least 20 minutes so that the knots themselves can actually take to color. Um, I notice if you leave it longer Sometimes your roots will be too blonde, so I think 20 minutes will be the maximum. 